Okay, hi everybody. This is my first YouTube video ever. Or well, almost first. So excuse me for my English or if I don't do things properly, but I just figured I wanted to help other people. Um, if you're a programmer and you program in C Sharp or any other language, you sometimes have to make these tedious UML diagrams. And I always like to use uh, plant UML to, uh, to make them quicker. But it also means that I have to write them myself and I have to make them myself, which is also tedious. So I found this uh, visual code extension um, from, from Pierre 3 from GitHub. Um, it's this one, C sharp to plant UML. Um, there's also a GitHub, a GitHub page if you want to, uh, to read more on it. But the visual code extension enables you to make it, uh, 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 make it a more quick process. Um, it's really easy to use, but you have to know how to use it. And I noticed that on the GitHub page, uh, I, I, on the issues, there were other people who also found it, well, difficult to use or did not know how to use it. So I thought, why not just make a video about it? Um, well, you just, you first start by installing the visual code extension, obviously. If you've done so, you can now uh, go to, well, to your install extensions tab. You can click on this one and you can go to featured contributions. And you see there's a command here that enables you to run the program. Uh, before I did so, I first went into preferences, settings, went to the C sharp to plant UML and made the input path to my current directory. You can also put something else there, obviously. And here you have the output path, uh, so it defaults to plant UML directory. It just creates it when you run it. After that you go, well, you don't need to go anywhere. Just click this gone and I press control shift P and you run this command, which is here. So you run this command. It then creates this directory. It has all your PAML files in it, or whatever you call it, your plant UML files. I then just open the terminal, um, ran plant UML. It started doing some stuff. Would be nice if it would do it today. And that's it. You now have a have a sort of plant UML diagram. I still have to figure out how to do these lines more correctly and how to make it a little bit more neat because it looks a bit weird, but the basics of it work. It's really easy. Well, I hope this helps. Bye.